right. There's the roll. There okay. it is. <laughs> How do you know, Nicole? Without no, I looking just, at I my screen. I see it. Screen. I see it. But uh, here we are. As you heard in the intro, we already introduced you guys yeah. before we even got in the studio. Wow. But nice. we we're joined. We dropped the website and everything. And we got <laughs> nice. Oh, thank you thank guys. We're joined so by Patrick yeah. and Rickley. Um, this first time you're on camera, Rickley. I mean, yeah. obviously for Patrick. But she's oh, been on the show. Nice. No nice. camera last time. Her prestige. Just that was oh, the good old days. Was a good uh, I think there's more pressure this time. Okay. <laughs> you know, really got to control the face. Don't worry about Everyone it. Everyone listening that heard your voice before is going to YouTube now. But... Yeah. You guys can follow them and listen to their podcast. Let's be realistic. Uh, <laughs> do you make eye contact? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I do. I do all the time. Is this like a sitcom? Is this reality TV? Wave. I don't know what. The, I don't know what. You do whatever you're talking about. What you're doing, so people go watch it on YouTube. <laughs> yes. You know what I mean, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. so I, I look at the camera like all the time. <laughs> this guy sounds like a fucking trainer. Yeah, 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 exactly, I gotta check exactly. this shit out, man. Uh, exactly. LBRpodcast.com <laughs> has all their links there. Um, That's right. Your social medias are all LBR. I maintain it almost never. <laughs> Meaning you don't we post? <laughs> no, but the links are real. Oh, okay. The LBR yeah. links are definitely good, real. Yeah, yeah. We just, we, uh, we, I don't know if you've, you have probably haven't listened to Rogue One yet. Was yes, that Rogue I One? Yes, I did. I finished it today. Every oh, Tuesday. Wow. She's, she's, you guys she's listen. Rickley is our biggest I'm fan, a true fan, honestly. And she realized I spelled Rogue wrong. Yeah. Rouge, Rouge One. Rouge. I listened. It was still Rouge One when I listened. I woke so up. You're welcome. <laughs> Nobody knows that except for Rickley. <laughs> <laughs> she hit us up and warned us. They all know now. That my, yeah. She's done that a few times. I think she's let us know about mistakes. Yeah, like uh, the silence. Sound we had a si- Yeah, silence in our episodes. I'm either I, really annoying or really helpful. So. I never listen to it once it's out. Same. I don't either. I don't either of ours. I'll so. skim through it right at the Do end of the editing. Down? Do you like give you yourself the listen though? Like I, I, I listen to ours for like two minutes and then I like, fast forward. How long? <laughs> is there a threshold? No, there I don't is. Know. I don't know. There is on Does some, but I'm not view? telling Nicole because now she's just going to abuse it. So <laughs> no, I'll I don't tell you. Listen after. Don't you want the views? Dude, it, I'm just it doesn't trying to matter, help us. bro. I'm just trying to help it's us. It's just for the fun. You're right. You're right. <laughs> <laughs> what are we drinking? It's not for the money at all. Um, We're not, well, We don't have cans. Them. You ordered them. Oh. They're yeah, no thank you, by the way. They're, the Rick, the girls are drinking Stoic Cider, and Local. the boys are drinking some kind of IPA. I don't know what it is. It's kind of hazy. It's yeah. Borderlands it's Tool IPA. Borderlands I think they're in Tool. Tucson, and we're drinking Prescott. Oh, all which Arizona. Is Arizona. Are you from Peoria or Prescott? I always forget. Peoria. Okay, Peoria. Yeah. You're from one of the weird P's. And yeah. I'm always like weird. weird. Mm-hmm. West Valley. Peoria. It's yeah. like normal. <laughs> Prescott's like out there, you know. Yeah. Like Pure like, is like. I never, I have never met somebody, and they're like, oh yeah, like expect uh, Yuma's a big one where they're like, oh yeah, I'm from Yuma. That that's insane. Ew. Wait but till you meet that yeah. person that's from like Baghdad, Arizona. Oh Actually, we know somebody. We know what? some twins from Baghdad. Yeah. Twins. I thought they Double. were really from like Iraq. I laughed, yeah. <laughs> and they're like, no, it's in Arizona. I'm yeah. Like, <laughs> the first Baghdad. time I saw it, I thought I like I literally thought somebody had like hacked the google maps and was like <laughs> just, just put, put it in baghdad because it's the middle of the desert so yeah. i was like yeah baghdad oh i get it and then so somebody's like no it's, from a, there. it's a city no. or he had lived or there village. he lived there yeah what how I'll many people Sawyer. live there like seven probably wow tops i'll ask sawyer that i thought no one i'm lived pretty here. sure he lived there why he lived though one, i don't know his family that's crazy to me yeah weird <laughs> i'll get confirmation <laughs> on that i'll correct that later i'm sure but uh shoot man we're doing war movie Wh- have war we movie. Have we done a lot of war movies? No, we no. haven't done any zero. This is like the first one. This is it. Yeah. I am. I. Uh, I'm Are so you excited. So yeah, yeah. This is. Uh, We've done my favorite. Genre we did like movies. Triple Frontier. We did. That wasn't really war. Yeah, it's though. not a war movie. That's yeah. like an Drug inside job. cartel. Yeah. yeah. FBI Heist movie. movie. We do spy yeah. movies a lot for funsies. War movies are kind of hard to do sometimes, and we th- we've thought about doing it like Saving Private Ryan and yeah. different ones, but. Um, 1917 we all went we saw it in imax mm-hmm. yeah not or no we yeah, saw it in dolby. the dolby oh, that's atmos right, that's right. 4d experience <laughs> not sponsored <laughs> not <at all. laughs> no sponsor that was a free marketing was, for them but uh really is that like comparable to imax well the screen isn't like as it. big and but what is IMAX even? Just a big s- yeah, wide shot and the stuff? shots are in okay. like 70 millimeter. Like Have you ever been on... You um, only want to go to IMAX for movies that are like fully shot in IMAX. Like Chris Nolan the movies. Always okay. He does all of his in IMAX Have you ever film. went to Disneyland? California Adventure? Yeah. Soaring over California? Yeah. The screen's like that. Almost. Yeah. yeah. Well, I've been, but I've like, curved, what's the but difference yeah. between yeah. what we saw and IMAX? Yeah, exactly. Are the ticket I mean? prices the same? Screen. You'll pay a little bit more, but our 4D one was way more. I like But the, the, the audio was nuts in there. Yeah, the chair shook, right? What? Yeah. They like shook. 
Yeah, the oh, that's, that's the four D. Yeah, that's that's the four D thing. That's yeah. such crap. You so make if you vibrate that. and there's a fourth dimension, you don't remember. I don't remember the chair shaking. What, yeah. dude? Yeah, there was like impact vibration. When bombs were going off, okay. yeah. he was just in the mode. Yeah, he was like, yeah, I was. I mean, I was there, you know, I'm like <laughs> shell shocked. <laughs> I forgot. I don't remember anything. Um, yeah, the, I don't know. I don't know if that's necessarily worth it. I don't know. Hmm. It. I guess it depends on the movie you go see, and. Granted, a war movie might be really good for this 4D experience, but this wasn't really like, you know, Michael Bay, like your typical like explosions and stuff. No. It was very slow. It was uh, an emotional war movie. It was yeah. emotional, yeah. It was like more of In a some sense, drama. Like, I guess they're all emotional. Yeah. But I wouldn't say it's anti-war either. It's it wasn't like it's an just yeah. like action. A story. Yeah, so war, m- war movies typically fall into like three main categories where it's like just pure action, mm-hmm. uh, like a historical reenactment or an anti-war film. And I don't really think that 1917 fell into any one of those. Mm. That's why it's interesting. Yeah. And did you did you like it? I don't know if that's skipping ahead. Yeah, you can go. And I don't know. Yes. Okay. Yes, I think just the easiest answer is yes. Yeah. I liked it. Just okay. first impressions. Rickley, you walked yeah. out of the theater. What did you feel? I liked it. Yeah. Yeah. Walked out. It was. You fine. didn't like. I it. don't like war movies in general. Okay. Yeah. But like, I mean, it, I, 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 can I say that I'm neutral on it? it yeah. It's like, eh, whatever. I liked it mainly because of the, the whole reason, like the whole hype behind the movie was that it's filmed like one shot, mm-hmm. and that was like my biggest thing. And going what do you into mean? It. Explain yourself. You, you watched don't it. No, I know, but what do you mean filmed so in one shot? It's like fi- it's, it oh. looks like it's filmed in one shot. Mm-hmm. Oh, there's no not a lot of cuts. There's no stuff. clear yeah. cuts. Okay, okay, All okay. their cuts are when they do they, like move they walk through a wall or exactly. they walk okay, through yeah. a doorway, that's a cut. They call them hidden oh. cuts. So it's all natural. If you, you should have told me this before. I thought Sam. I told you, I oh. swear. You saw the marketing for the movie. No. Oh, before no. we recorded. I don't pay attention to well, anything. Roger Deakins is a master. So I love all of his work, 2049, you know, Blade Runner and all that kind of mm. stuff. But I need to watch that. I know. Um, oh, my gosh. And yeah. he did deserve the cinematography Oscar. So I have mm-hmm. some thoughts on the one shot, but we'll get there. I don't know what okay. we're starting but with. But I think place. that was like the biggest hype for me yeah. was there's I could probably name a couple shots, clear cuts in it. Like when he walks through the barbed wire, like it, the barbed wire like covers the whole screen. That's a cut. That's so clever. It is really clever. They mm-hmm. do it really well. When those are done hidden in movie like normal movies, there's a scene of uh Children of Men. Have you guys seen that? Yep. No, I want Clive to. Owens? The yeah. car yeah. scene. Clive, yeah, yeah, where he gets out of the car. Like that you know that whole car scene where they're fighting, they're getting shot at in that car. First it's off, it's been a while. Yeah, but it's first off, I'll send you a link to okay. like a breakdown of it. First off, that whole camera work there is insane hmm. because you're in a car, but the camera's in between all four people spinning, oh. and and these the cameras are huge. Wild. So they have so they move. have this huge rig like yeah. hooked up to the car, but the the actors had to like dodge dodge oh the cameras gosh. behind it and stuff. And the girl that like dies in the scene, she had to like get out of the way like when it was like moving and stuff. That's nuts. Um, but he gets out of the car. Was, what was the what was the lady's name? The girl. Julianne oh. Moore, right? Julianne yeah, Moore. And she yeah. Shot in the head. yeah, yeah. Yes. Spoiler yes. alert. Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> well, yeah. all right. Oh. It's it's not a film girl pod if we don't spoil okay. another she movie that this is on. <laughs> Without <laughs> saying, like, we were come on, that was like that, that came out of like what 2002 or something. I just you guys say so. spoiler in your intro. Yeah, so we're good. We're good. We, sometimes my oh, first introduction to Julianne Moore was Boogie Nights, so I can't. Oh, she was in that. Yes, she was. Yeah. Both of her. It was wild. <laughs> I was don't like remember. 13. I used to like that movie a lot, yeah, but I, I don't remember. I don't remember. Dirk Diggler, man. Mark and Mark. <laughs> uh-huh. What up? Yep. Anyways. Yeah. But there, yeah. that scene, when he gets out of the car, it crosses the car panel, and it continues the shot, and that's the hidden cut. How many times do you think they had crazy. to do that? In this movie? No, that, that scene. Oh. I don't know. Do you know how many moving ten. parts there are? Ten. Yeah. That's nuts. There's a lot going on in You'd those. You'd just be so I, tired. Yeah, just doing it. That That's why we were saying we always say like we, acting is fucking. It's the I would never be able to the do. The memory, oh my gosh, yes. the emotion, and like, like what matching, if you're having an off day, and like matching real emotion to make it look normal, yeah, yeah. not like how you think it's supposed to look. Make it yeah. feel natural. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Do you guys like the acting in this movie? I don't think I thought anything of the acting. I was really I stressed think, out. Honestly, so I, think it was I good. feel like if you're an though. actor, yeah, this maybe. is the easiest movie you could have done. There's not a ton, a ton no, of No, I'm just saying. Yeah, there's not a lot well, of like. Well, like enough stuff is like you can just be scared and alarmed or like, s- 
like no dialogue things. is sometimes the hardest to that's do that. That's true. That's true. Yeah. And it's just, I, you're, yeah, it's just I don't the know. Two yeah. I don't, I don't, I don't know. Yeah. I, it's like they did, they, they were believable, but there wasn't, there wasn't a ton of. That's acting. what I'm saying. I mean, it was and just like. Convers- yeah. A lot of it was conversations between the two of them before the one. I guess the dies. biggest, um, God, like display part. of acting uh, was the scene where he gets stabbed. Yeah. By the was that not the most frustrating thing you've ever seen in your freaking oh, yeah, life? It was. It was. Sure. Oh my gosh. Yeah. I thought, I thought from the previews that the movie was about him. Yep. Yeah, that's so did I. And then, so yeah. Yeah. And so then like, oh, he gets stabbed and, you know, and then they're going to like patch him up and it's Yeah, it'd be exactly. fine. Not he even just dies through. right there. No, yeah. I was, was I was kind of thrown off. I yeah. was like, yeah, shit. It it, well, because the movie is about his brother, right? right. Is in the, His brother's the one that's in the other yeah. battalion That or he's trying to find. Yeah, and then he just dies like a third of the way in. I would say that's like a third of the way yeah, in. It's not even halfway. Fairly early. That was just like, oh my gosh, I was so mad about that. I know, and Why the are you worst part about guy? it. Just don't say The worst him. part about it was like, oh, now it's like a solo thing, like solo yeah. survival. And yeah. they had like the bond going through this together. Well, yeah, they barely. If he died him. like when they were almost there, I would yeah. have been okay. Like, right. Well, that would have been really frustrating. Mm-hmm. That's true. I was more frustrated yeah. with. But like, where the do we milk. kill this man? So uh, <laughs> when I saw the milk. <laughs> In the pale, I was like, that means somebody is living in this house or and they're going to get escapes, shot or yeah. like, yeah. Mm-hmm. But so, and then it means nothing. It meant nothing. It meant nothing. But they gave it to the baby later on, it which is, I mean, they bring amateur, it back. Amateur okay. camera work. Wow. So like, amateur directing, like, okay, I could see that coming Sam from Mendes a mile away. Sam Mendes getting called out. Like yeah. He's yeah, but you also would have seen it coming from a mile away if someone was hiding behind the barn or something. That's easily mm. leading to that, too. It's not more complicated. I just can't imagine that mm. there be there was cattle that close to the um, <laughs> the front. <laughs> Patrick no, coming really in with like the most logical reasoning. Wait, there was one living cow, right? Yeah. yeah. So yeah. It, oh yeah that thing would have ran like, like yeah. a yeah. long time ago, with all that artillery going off and yeah. stuff. Well, like, they probably would have killed it for one. That too. They either oh. killed it for food or they killed it when they um, retreated. Well, so part of like part of the diet of that time, uh, they they determined that like barley and wheat actually gave you more calories mm. than it took it w- to like so raise a yeah, cow if you just something? if you just oh. ate the barley and wheat you would have more calories than if you fed the cow to to feed you guys yeah, oh. yeah. you guys so they huh. um so what they did but is like the milk though is that important mm-hmm. yeah <laughs> I, don't I don't want think milk think like when i'm in war yeah, i mean isn't it a myth that it helps your bones though that's a myth yeah doesn't it like actually suck calcium yeah. from your bones like bro are you fucking kidding me i've never heard that's that's true i've never heard that that's, that's, yeah. that's yeah. why yeah. the campaign turned from wow uh, calcium to for protein, strong bones right? to protein yeah good source of protein remember it used to say calcium it doesn't say calcium bro got milk is that a that's a what is that a burn bernstein bears moment kind of thing about no, no, no. It you it did it did say calcium. It did say okay. They switched it because yeah, gotcha. yeah, no, no, no. because it's a lie. That yeah. would be cool though. Yeah. Okay. That's but is it good? Is theory. it still good? You know, like runners drink chocolate milk. Is that still like the thing? I mean, it's Ooh. just carbs and protein. That's so what you need. Anyway. So I heard you're supposed to eat a dark chocolate after you work out. Like that's good. Like a milk. any amount of carbs that aren't just like. I heard you're supposed to eat 15 wings <laughs> <laughs> dipped in ranch. <laughs> <laughs> After any sort of exertion like of your diet. energy. Yeah, okay, perfect. <laughs> I'm down. Wait, okay. So would, right they, you wake up. would they eat the barley straight up? Did they try to do anything fancy with it? Did they try to drain um, it? They would make things like um, like Ezekiel bread, uh, oh, okay. stuff like that. Okay. So just like some really crappy. Sounds <laughs> okay, terrible. Okay, dry. Yeah, dry really stuff. bad food. Yeah. I think of, yeah. I think of uh, not fucking, I think of Lord of the Rings where he they have like the bread wrapped in the yep. leaf. S- or that like a stupid oh, yeah, little cloth. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's me. That's me and Nicole in the war. I'm like, Seriously? that's all we have. <laughs> Sam just yeah. always trying to keep freaking what's his name alive, Frodo alive. Yeah. <laughs> well, Mr. that was Frodo. a huge thing in this movie. The, the little, well, not a huge, but in the beginning, the the bread. It was like oh a yeah. theme throughout. I think of like, or well, it, like it, it circled food. back. I have yeah. no recollection of the bread. Mm. They, when they were walking, he's like, "Oh, I'm hungry," and then the guy had a oh, bread. Oh, oh, it was oh. like showing you that right they in the like beginning, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah it was like yeah. showing you that they would like not like stash food whenever they got it. So because they yeah. never know how long it would probably be until yeah. they got fed again. I, I remember it comes up again later on in the movie. I think uh, somehow, but obviously I forget now. Um, Sorry, yeah, we now I'm trying to remember where the when he of is. Bread. It sound familiar? Yeah, uh, yeah. it does. It yeah, does. It sounds very familiar. I, I maybe like at the that. end when he's like go maybe get food I, or something it might be with the the mom the little baby oh. and the mom maybe like he do you like that part eh. there's always Again, in every war movie there's like always a civilian interaction exactly does that happen a but lot like we need a how long could here. she really 
live down there. That well, whole place was on fire, bro. Right. But ha- it had just got on fire, right? <laughs> <laughs> but look at I don't know. the town. Like, how long has she uh, been there through true, this destruction? True. You know that the big burning church? Yeah. I'm mad. That's CG. Did you know that? That's why no. I won. That's why I won the visual effects. Yeah, oh, I was mad. Oh my gosh. Okay. Did that you was my favorite it? scene. No, oh. I thought I it was real. After. That was my favorite okay, scene. So I was gonna say it. you're gonna you're gonna ask a question later on that <laughs> might have a different answer. <laughs> Son of a. Oh so no. So they did yeah. a good job. They did a great yeah, job, yeah. but also I was like, That's how much? Disappointing. I was that mad that it won the visual effects Despite. because how much visual effects was in it was it just that exactly, one and like yeah. a couple other things but, it was convincing. Sure it was but think about what it would take to actually set something that big on fire and make it real and like what if something gets messed up someone runs through the shot they you're like, I can't, I can't didn't they do that in dark again. night the pile oh, of yeah. money joker was on he they literally they, lit that on they, fire sh- they lit shit up that's because it's chris nolan that's true yeah i'm just a chris nolan fanboy and, and what well, deacons did do dark night i want to look at that cinematography for nolan though yeah in like inception maybe yeah maybe he didn't i don't know I, but I was like, come on, you have movies like Avengers Endgame, yeah. which has great visual effects. Like Thanos itself is like a huge visual effects accomplishment. Yeah. Like that's okay. I see the way his saying. pores stretch and like he has beard oh, yeah. stubble. And but like do we know the budget of this movie versus something like an Avengers movie? Maybe that's they did a lot. It might be comparable, but had. also like. You know, I'm saying a lot of more of their time for those types of movies go into their visual effects. Yeah, but like, whereas like 1917 has a couple main ones, and the church one is really good because I yeah. thought it was real yeah, too. Yeah, I noticed. I noticed. I noticed. Um, and I was like, fuck. when they showed it, I was like, it's gonna win. Yeah, I was like, what? <laughs> yeah, uh, when yeah. they showed it at the well, Oscars, but um, oh. with well, the scene where uh, where there were the final charge where they were going yeah. over the parapet, mm-hmm. when he ran into the guy running, I, I thought that was those real. Are, that was like that's a real improv, interaction. Yeah. Did so you tell us that? It yeah. wasn't improv. It was well, an accident. They yeah, that's what I meant. Yeah. But yeah. he improv and kept going. Uh, so yeah. They didn't yeah, stop yeah. shooting. I love that. Yeah. Well, they, they had rehearsed it to where that didn't happen like five times. Yeah. And the one take that they actually filmed it. Which it I happened. heard it was the first one. And they're really? like, let's go with it. Uh, maybe they just spicing it up. A <laughs> bit. Like, yeah, it was the first one. I just had to go with it, you know. They were Oscar campaigning. Yeah, you know, Grandpa said it happened. Oh. <laughs> that's right. That's right. Yeah, because his his grandpa yeah. was in World War One. Yeah, but it wasn't yeah. like a direct, um, like it wasn't the story of his time. Right? It wasn't yeah. a story about him or like anything like that. But he I think it was letters like letters or yeah. s- other stories that he told. Yeah. about oh, yeah, World story. War One. They said it at the end. So maybe right? they kind of like mashed them in the one. Maybe like a bunch of other stories in the one, yeah, yeah, yeah. kind of thing. Well, but was the um so when the guy when the kid got stabbed and he turns pale, was that CG or was that makeup? Do you think like because it was one take, you know? I don't know how they do those in movies. It's was, actually very I, interesting. I noticed that very clearly, and that was like I was whoa. I was tripped out that whole time. Yeah, it's freaking yep. worse, man. Me too. It was actually uh, well, I just scream, felt it. That was, see, talk about acting. That scream was really good. Yeah. So he did really That's good job. Oh, was, I, I was just that. pissed, and yes, I was uh, and I was like yeah. feeling myself bleeding out in the theater. Yeah, yeah that was very so like not visceral. that it was that graphic, but like but that just, seemed real. Yeah, like yeah. what would happen? At, I thought stomach wounds took like a long time to but die. But you're gonna that's what generally. I thought. Yeah, that's what I thought. But, but you're gonna bleed a lot. Really know. They weren't holding uh, pressure on it. And maybe it hit an organ. We don't know. Maybe it hit like liver. They didn't try. They didn't try. Does liver end you right away? I don't know. I don't know. I would think so. It's Nazi knives, man. We'll go deep. Oh, why are we so trying nice. to save them, by the right, way? Right, right. Well, they weren't, they weren't Nazis at the time. Yeah, but why are you World trying War to War. save an enemy anyway? What were they again? The They're just Germans. Just Germans, yeah. yeah. Just the Regardless. cross. The cross, Rookie whatever. mistake. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, but there's, there's a rookie mistake. Yeah. They were... <laughs> they took a hit. They well, but they, were, they weren't mm-hmm. like... They, they weren't like super battle hardened yeah. soldiers, anyways. So I mean, they they're kids, still yeah. yeah, they're still pretty That's pretty green when so it comes sad. to like. That. Oh. Out of all the shit I've seen out there, I would have blew that guy away. He landed. Right. <laughs> or just left him in the thing. Yeah. Although that's a really bad death. I, yeah. But that's just so sad that it's like their humanity comes out and they're like trying to yeah, be kind save and them. That's how it goes. Killed. Maybe yeah. he thought he was gonna be a POW. You never know. Yeah, I don't know. Um, it Prisoner of War. I, I guess in that situation, it's just kind of weird because there are it, it, like the the Christmas truce, and I think I don't think it was 1917. I think it was earlier on, um, but just one time during Christmas, Christmas, Christmas Eve. They like didn't fight. They just ended up not fighting. There was uh, there's like mm. a, a pretty well documented like story of the two sides playing a uh, soccer match. And exchanging what? presents, but then oh. like on other sides of the tra- like other sides of the line, yeah. Um, 
you know, people would like the Germans would come over and be like, hey, you know, Merry Christmas, truce, and they'd just get blown away. So. Jeez. Yeah. Can you have that so uh, mean? Oh, I, know, so I mean, <laughs> but things were so different, <laughs> too. Like, communications uh, were so different. So, like, you could have a totally different war. Like, this like a mile movie, down the road. This whole yeah. movie yeah. is, like, so trying to get a message somewhere. Yeah, so I could see that happening. That's, yeah. that's crazy. I mean, you walk up on my trench. <sighs> Well, like, yeah, there's no question who the enemy is. Yeah, like, you're you just like, it, yeah, it's not like. That's what why if you don't help them. What, what if their presence a freaking bomb, dude? Yeah. Wait, so right. were th- was the general? Was it confirmed that what they were crossing was empty, or they were kind of like, we heard it was empty, but you guys need to cross it to the get to where you're going? The Germans did I that. It was just no like man's land. It was yeah. like that. I think it was like we're pretty yeah. sure it's empty. They like did. You never well, know. the Germans okay. did that tactic quite a bit. I read they just flee. Really? Destroy everything when they flee. Well, and then the booby traps, is and that booby, real? That's, that's oh what I'm saying. They would yeah. set up like all this shit. That freaking rat. Are oh you serious? The rat. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> it's the worst. The I can't believe you don't feel that. your butt shaking yeah, after that, Yeah, how did you dude? not feel it there? <laughs> I just, I, you the whole know what? I mean, I, I just remember like being It was so loud as hell, yeah. too. It was so loud. Pretty sure I have PTSD. <laughs> when it was dark and it was like... <laughs> stressful. It was yeah. freaking stressful. Well, cause it's like a zombie movie. Yeah, you know something bad's... Yeah, just, just being, about yeah, to happen. Alone yeah. is like claustrophobic. Yeah. yeah, you know something bad's gonna happen. Uh, so the worst. They, I I read that they were known for doing things like that. Well, just like they would go up. kill all the livestock, like oh, do anything to like it's just hurt. Just mean, Nicole. It's what yeah. I'm saying. What? It's just not mean. killing animals? No, all of it. <laughs> Everything they're doing is <laughs> oh, the mean. The m- mental killing animals. Mental games. The booby traps. Yeah. I know. Oh yeah, the dead dogs and stuff yes. that we saw. Uh, I wish I didn't see that. Mm-hmm. They just had to throw mm-hmm. it in there. Yeah. They're like, what do we need in this scene? Just throw it. But it's yeah, probably like, like it, what it was like. Poor yeah. Brooke, she was sitting by me, and, and she was like cried. Panning, and then, no, I saw the dog, and I don't think she saw. It, and I was like, oh my god, the dog! And she was like, don't point it out. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I'm sorry. Oh, no. <laughs> I had yeah. to. The uh, the putrefied, like dead, decaying Ooh. body is is actually really accurate. Yeah. And I thought that that was a really interesting take. I'm yeah. like, yeah. Like in the pits, in the yep. river, in the yep. river, yeah, that creating was the worst. a car. When he had to swim through him, and that's when he lost it. That's yeah. When he was like, no, right. when he w- climbed on top of them to get to land, right? Yeah, yeah. 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 That's what I'm saying. And then when <laughs> he got to land, he finally like broke All down. and everything. Uh, <sighs> what did, uh, rough, rough. what was in the bags for the rats? Oh, yeah. What do you think was in the bags? Were they grenades? That The stuff that was hanging from the ceiling that the rat dropped. So the rats were trying to eat it like it was like, it was almost food? like. They it's probably true. food and grenades or something. Do you think they, uh, they put that up there because they knew rats would like go into there? And, and collapse. Well, no, it wasn't grenades because when it dropped, it didn't. It didn't go off. It was a tripwire. No, or the it was rat a trip went wire. over the wire. That's yeah. why. Yeah. Oh. The rat but ran into the wire. It, it dropped from. The, yeah, yeah. That's that. that that's what made the noise. It seems like food of some sort. I honestly thought it was gonna be human body parts. And some of it looked bloody. That. Some okay, of it looked bloody. So they I would eat that. Yeah, because they would. Yeah. Um, I don't know. So I know th- the only thing I know about grenades is that they were invented during World War One. Yeah. So by 1917, probably weren't. Oh my god! They're really? Pro- yeah. So the. The British used to use what was called bully beef. It's like this, like really super salty, so greasy, like nasty point. beef can. They just <gasps> fill it up with explosives and wrap it in twine, and then just yeah. put a, a wick on it and throw, throw it. it. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Wait, so what were the wa- what's the one with the stick? That's the a, a German World War. Grenade. That's okay, a World okay. War Two. We saw that in Jojo Rabbit. Yeah. they had that. I'm sure they had it at the end of World War One. Yeah, I think they did. It's really good. World War Two and World War One weren't that far away, which is kind of no. They never even a recovered. direct result of one another. Yeah. Okay. Well, uh, I'm not afraid to ask stupid questions, so I'll <laughs> ask it. Here. Do it up. Let's hear it. <laughs> when did uh, conscription is the term? Is that the right term? Yes. When did that take effect? Was it before this war or after this war? I don't even know what you're talking about. Uh, so you're smarter than me. Conscription, okay. actually. <laughs> so I'm, I'm lost. <laughs> okay. Right. 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 Uh, you know, so Mr. History teacher. Yeah. Like when does <laughs> when did, when <laughs> did they McQueen. when did they conscript people? Uh, I'm not I'm not 100 percent sure. What does that mean? Hello. So it's like being drafted. Oh, okay. oh. Okay, okay, okay. Um, well, but it's a law, right? Was it the law, or is it just the term for being drafted? I don't actually know. Okay. I know that there were huge campaigns to get people, obviously, to to join the yeah. war effort. Um, I'm so proud I stomped it. Yeah, <laughs> interesting. Like, uh, and I have no idea what you're talking about. It's on record. <laughs> the famous one is a guy by the name of Lord Kitchener. He's the one. He's like he's got this big long like beard, and he's he like is the one that was like pointing oh. towards people. He's like Lord Kitchener. Like join his group of like wait, he's Uncle Sam. No, 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 he's no like he's Uncle, Uncle Sam, Sam was resemblance of. The yes. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. They um, probably saw how pr- how ex- successful it was. Yeah. And just the pointing like alone. People love the mustache. It. It's the mustache. They want they me to yeah. do what? <laughs> 
<laughs> well, it's like, you know, oh, got to free clothes and guns. You know? Yeah. No, just no. Oh, God. Respect <laughs> to all the veterans, you know, honestly. <laughs> like. So it's uh, so I don't know the answer to that. Yeah. I know that okay. you know at different times, um, conscription became mandatory. I mean, but everyone was really young, and yeah. it oh, seemed yeah. like they were not there by choice at first. But then some of them have been there so long that they're just like, well, this is what I do now. Yeah. Crazy thing though is that for most of the soldiers in World War One, it was for the duration of war. Oh so my god! Yeah, really? It yeah, it wasn't like a term, you know, like a term or like a tour of duty where, here until like in Vietnam, over. you were there for a year Shit. or something like, like that. You go till we win, bro. Oh yep. my god! You die. Can yep. you imagine? Oh my no! Gosh. Absolutely. Yeah. Not. And I well, think, and I think, uh, if we had a new world war, to a scale, you know, close to or more, it would probably be close to that. Like I think tours would be way different. Um, I, I, I yeah. think because we have tours. Because we're fighting war on terrorism, which is stupid in its own way. Because mm-hmm. it's never, g- it's never gonna yeah. end. <laughs> it's never, yeah. But like, they have to invent this like tour system now because it's like it's never gonna end. That's right. So That's right. But uh, maybe no. if we get into a world war type thing, it would be like Over you're in this real. zone and we can't really pull you out because it's uh. not really like viable right now. So yeah. you're I just hope, gonna be I there. Would hope we're yeah, like well, like, or nicer. And in World War Two, when yeah. when the the Russians, there's you know five to ten million Russians just heading straight for, for germany i mean yeah. it's it's down to the last man because at that point it's like a fight for survival yeah you know you were going yeah. to get taken over stalingrad that's just, was that's nuts it, like no, that's fight for like survival no, no, Me neither. Nope. no thank you but in the movie the main guy that we follow through the whole movie he talks about going home he's like i couldn't take it yeah that's so what i mean like it's just his life now like he can't not be doing this but anymore. i thought you said they c- couldn't go home like Duration of war. Oh wait, he went home in the war. Yeah, he that's said? what. Yeah, well, no, no, that's yeah. Right. He, did, he yeah. did say that. He like said when that. he was like, I. He was said I went. They didn't home seem like they were very like like Patterson. Like there weren't like veterans. Maybe like, hard it was and like. Yeah. Um, yeah. I don't. Maybe it was like a break. Like you got to go home one time during the year. Like or for I could Christmas be misreading or something. It? I don't know. Oh, did it? I thought he did get. Um, I thought or maybe he, he got hurt. I think he got hurt. Maybe he got hurt and got sent back out. Uh, but, but he, he did, did say that. you can't do war anymore. <laughs> yeah, but if they need you, <laughs> not that when bad. you're not losing. <laughs> not <laughs> World War One, man. Not when not they don't yeah. give a shit. Yeah, maybe yeah. he got. There was nothing set up different. back then. You got to remember. Way different. Yeah. There was no like VA, nothing in that. It was no. just like, hey, can no. you stand? We're going. You saw those tents, those infirmary tents. Oh my <gasps> god! It is. Uh, I knew it was coming. Absolutely not. Yeah. It is the. I find it more fascinating than World War Two because it is just the most insane like meat grinder of a right. war that there's ever been. Right. Yeah. It's but you just had bizarre. such like periods of stalemate between zones. Yeah. Like you would literally fight for inches and yeah. feet. Thousands of people would that just is die, absurd. and God. and then y- the next day you lose it. It's like, <laughs> so yep. dumb. Tactics were just so different, and that's what's also amazing is what technology in terms of like planes, guns, mm-hmm. bombs, tanks, GPSing, everything what's around you. from from World War One, the end of World War One to World War Two, and now it's like a totally different game and st- strategies. Obviously, probably because they studied World War One, but. Um, you know, so much change. Like it's a completely different, different feel. I don't. I don't know. Do you guys rather be in World War One or World War Two? One thousand. Well, it depends. <laughs> I guess on what, which, which side. Um, um, two. Your native side. I think I'd probably. <laughs> I like two, history of sure, World yeah, War Two. So if I were an American soldier, I'd probably want to be in World War One. Because they were in it for like what two years. Uh, so they At they the joined in end? 1917. Oh really? And ah. so of the, of the roughly Sam Mendes, I yeah, see you, bro. Right. <laughs> so of the like hundred ish thousand American soldiers that died in the First World War, I would say about half died from influenza, oh. not Jesus. the coronavirus. The coronavirus. Wow. The coronavirus. Of That's right. No, Difference, uh, yeah. guys. Compa- trendy. <laughs> yeah. Be trendy. <laughs> Compared to about uh, 480,000 in. Jeez. Yep. Yep. In World War Two. So, well, it's, I mean, if you if you look at the Rus- Russian, the Russians and the Chinese uh, lost about 20 million. Holy. A piece. Combined. Oh, yeah. a, piece. a piece. So I think China is the leader at 21 million. Because They're also the leader yeah, in coronavirus. W- yeah, we're so. willfully, willfully ignorant compa- uh, as to what the Japanese did to the Chinese in the Second World War. I saw a video of like the death in World War Two, and it's just like a visual chart. Yeah, it's fucking nuts. Like yeah. you see like yeah. the U.S. and it's like. Russia and you're yeah. like, oh yeah. <laughs> like holy shit, yeah. like, Terrifying. yeah, it's crazy. Um, 
Was it believable that the brother made it unharmed? His older brother that they were going to send the message to? Well, well his brother was like fighting there. to make it, right? Like, you right. already lost one brother. True. True. I mean, oh, so yeah, I was gonna say we don't know. We don't know if he mean? won. Yeah. We don't know if he made it. The older brother. No, I'm saying, I'm saying to you, like you, he gets to the end, and the brother literally has no scar. Like he's he not beat up. Well, he okay. looked like he, he was. Perfect. He was a higher rank, I thought. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So oh, he so was. He stays out of, Maybe okay. he's not in the front he, lines. He was like a sergeant or something. I don't know, but he wasn't. Well, because he was manning the tents, and everyone yeah. was there was mm-hmm. fucked up. Mm-hmm. But it's like, come on. I think he was there, and then those guys were coming back from battle, and he was like just helping them. At that point. <laughs> Damn. Um, but, I mean, the mission still kind of happens, though. I mean, they send the first couple waves. Yeah. Yeah. yeah they wouldn't listen die. to him. So or it was too late by then. Yeah. Like, yeah. he made it. He didn't make it on time then? He made it, like, 30 no, seconds I think he too did. late. Okay. I think know? he did make it on time because they ended up. Uh, Stopping a ton yeah, of I mean, people. They, from they really did call off the attack because at that, at that time, they would have just kept attacking and like yeah. is it believable as a movie if he makes it just in time and yeah, you know, yeah. nobody gets yeah, yeah. killed right I, right well, there's always a cost to mm-hmm. everything i so. wish they would have linked it to an actual event, event. yeah like one the major thing. battle um there's a, a an area called yapris and then the this the third battle uh, passchendaele they're like it's basically where they take a couple thousand artillery pieces and they put them on like a 15 mile stretch of of land mm-hmm. it and seems like that yeah so and, and this is just one yeah. figure but I've, I've, that. I've heard yeah. that it was higher that like basically you know half a million people died in a couple days holy um, shit yeah was just, just blasting each other what's also interesting is artillery. most of the war was just like was literally like in these open fields yep. yeah almost like revolutionary war style so where you're like you like plan it you're like meet me in oh freaking <laughs> yep meet me in tempe park you know <laughs> like 7 a.m. <laughs> we'll they each made other. the trenches themselves, right? They, they, like, well, they yeah, and that's what's yeah. crazy. And yep. some of them even Sold poured concrete and stuff. Like we saw that's that they insane. had concrete mm-hmm. and stuff. So well, the German you're just shelter there. was so elaborate. And yeah, uh, they had bunk um, beds, and clean, yeah. but clean too. Yeah. yeah, like the stone, like the trenches had stone and stuff, and like mm-hmm. ladders. Or was whatever. this yeah. well, this was in France, right? Mm-hmm. Uh, so at that right. time, I'm pretty sure it was. It, that could have been France. It could have been. I thought I'm pretty sure it was French. But I thought the movie been. was France. France. Well, because yeah. yeah, when he meets that girl, dude, with the baby, poor France, man. French. French. Yeah, boys, get, they're in a <laughs> pickle, man. <laughs> get right. out of there. That's right. They're in a bad spot, G. <laughs> I just could get run <laughs> over. Right. We need to move this country Jesus somewhere Christ. else. Like, <laughs> well, you know what? It it um, it's not a popular opinion, but World War Two is. The, I mean, they. They ha- they outnumbered the Germans, uh, you know, with, with like air power whatever. and yeah. tanks and and men. Um, well, a lot of people did. That's, yeah, that's and they the just funny part. they just kind of were like, I don't think it's gonna happen. And then when it started <laughs> happening, they're like, I don't know. When like, they started walking know. through Paris, they're like, mm. it well, doesn't look great. You know, but I mean, they didn't want to fight <laughs> because they just got out of you know yeah. six year war exactly. that was just the most insane thing ever, and they expected another really really long war, and they were like thinking, you know what? I don't know if it's really worth it, but Damn. then the Germans just rolled through yeah. and made it to the Atlantic and that was about it. But it wasn't, the takeover of France wasn't like bloody in any means. Like they just walked in, right? It was just like, did, did, France, did, France, part, yeah. did France have any sort of defense? In yeah. So they had what was called the Maginot line. Um, so there's an area kind of, so the Arden forest kind of is a, natural Ardennes barrier like yeah and then there's there was something called the maginot line which was essentially just like this massive massive uh like above ground trench it's like a line of um just fortified positions mm-hmm. um with stuffed with artillery and men manned uh, and the germans were just like just fucking go around <laughs> <laughs> they're like you know what yeah. no, here's what they'll never think they'll never think that we'll put our artillery in front of our soldiers and then we'll just go right through the Ardennes forest and they're like yep sounds good to me wow that's what they did yeah. so I like that issue. what I got from this movie like so they had abandoned the area that the, the two main characters were going across mm-hmm. the Germans and they were basically sieging these little towns that they were coming across. Because so the scene where he's um, after the kid died and like 
he gets shot in the head? What happened to him? Because that he did get shot in the head. He, he, How did he got he live? grazed. How no, did he, he live? but he got shot in like the ear or whatever. Yeah, but he got. I thought it. I and shot then, then he fell down. Well, he fell down the stairs. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. and he's there for a while, and that's God. That part was chaotic. Oh man, that, that part seriously. He wasted was. so much time well, on that. Floor. That's what got me. Yeah, yes. yeah. 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 wakes up in the middle of the night, like looks at his watch. What two hours? That's your priority. Is like. I might be dying, but, like, yep. how much time do I have left? <laughs> Me when I wake up that? in the morning. Yeah, that's I true. Know, that's yeah. true, yeah. But so, like, it seems like they had just, they had taken over that one and left, and then the scene, or the, the sequence where the town was on fire, it looks like either they were just taking that over and making that their base. Like, what were they doing? Just creating just, mayhem. Yeah, maybe, like... Because those two guys Looking that he resources. ran into were German, right? There yeah. was like German yeah. scattered, but not yeah. like a main force. Mm-hmm. So. The drunk also, guy. And it looked like toward a silhouette in fire. That yeah, we don't. I don't really know the the, the, the history a behind it's that. It's never a friend. Why? I don't really know the history behind that, but it looked like they had snipers or some kind of yes. like for traps too. Yeah, just to just to fuck with people. Like hey, the British are gonna come, and then we're just gonna you're gonna die, but you Shit. you can kill two of them. <laughs> Like, what if you're the German soldier? Like, you're gonna leave me here, and I like, <laughs> what? Uh, you want me to do what? Everything's on fire. <laughs> they they roll up in these tanks and you want in these trucks, and you want me to shoot one of them? Well, okay, because that stops the whole thing. I know? guess and the uh, whole column stops. Yeah, it's off. I gotta figure this out. This way for, <laughs> like, waits yeah, way yeah, too long. It takes a long time. Couple, I mean, a couple hours. Cover a lot of ground. Yeah, crazy. But it's a war of attrition, man. It was very. What if they bizarre. didn't cut when he was knocked out? We're just sitting there for two hours. <laughs> Like, I don't understand God why this damn. is a six-hour movie. <laughs> <laughs> Where does this end? The ticking clock as a soundtrack. Oh, my God. Directors love that shit. Using that. T- t- they love that. <laughs> For passing time. Yeah, You really exactly. feel it. Yeah. Um, That's interesting. Did you guys dislike anything? Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, you too? Yeah. Okay. You didn't dislike anything, Rick Lee? I mean, I'm horrible at this. <laughs> I'm terrible at being a critic. Um, I guess I disliked how... St- Stressful. I dislike the freaking. But no, that's, that's good though. Like the yeah, yeah, yeah. Of the movies. Okay, yeah. I don't have anything like that. Go. I felt like the camera work, like the whole one shot thing, oh. was very amateur. Amateur. We've seen it before, and it's like it was nothing new. Like we didn't. Okay, we've seen it before. Like so, you were saying. But we've never seen this before, besides maybe uh, Birdman. Mm. Exactly. And some, some and other I stuff. didn't. I didn't like Birdman that much. That was the strangest movie I think I've ever. Yeah, seen. but that's one. Like that's a yeah. one shot or a like one shot. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So yeah. in that one, I haven't watched it in a while. I only watched it when it came out. But it's Michael Keaton versus bro. this one. I know. Bye bye. In this one, you could clearly tell when the camera cut, like when the bomb dropped and the smoke. It was like okay. That was a cut to make it look oh, whatever. Yeah, yeah. There was I want to watch it again. Yeah, yeah, it, just, just, it, it just felt really amateur, and they were hyping it up. And uh, okay, the to Oscar be fair, campaign, to be fair, I was a little jaded over it because I thought it was going to win the Oscar over Parasite, and I now I know that it didn't. <laughs> um, so now, do you feel a little so better? I mean, I still think it's an amateur movie, but it okay, but, it is, but right? you got to think about the work that came into this because listen, when you're doing a one, a looking like a one shot movie. Everything, lighting, everything needs to look the same. So they would literally sit there yeah. because a fucking cloud would go over That's the sun yeah. and they, the shot wouldn't oh look the same if they went gosh. back. So they would just sit there and wait. Everyone's just waiting until the cloud passed and then they would shoot it. it yeah. So it, the lighting yep. was the same in most of those week. parts. Yeah. yeah. Roger Deacon said he had like 30 weather apps on his phone <laughs> to like get. Uh, so oh they would gosh. schedule like, okay, like three to five. We have like the best light. Like we yeah. need the to things like you don't even go think about. There. So there's a lot of work exactly. to go into that. Yeah. You know, yeah, maybe maybe it's not away. like the most intense like camera work, but like but there's a lot of work that goes into it. So um, there's a huge respect for that. Yeah, no, huge respect. I don't want to like take away any of it. I just again, I don't like war movies really. Um, I think if out of all of them, this one felt very. We gotta watch Jarhead, bro. I know, <laughs> very boring. It just felt like you'll like it because Jakey. I know I will. Um, but yeah, it just felt boring. You like, didn't think it felt like more emotional than other war movies? No, it did. It did that seems definitely. more your speed. Right. But for some reason, it just didn't hit me. And maybe it's because okay. the acting was kind of bland. I, we touched on that earlier. Yeah. But it was just kind of like, all What right. about when he, ke- when he came out of the river and had a meltdown? <laughs> Did he have a meltdown? Yeah, you don't remember him crying? He fell down and cried for like a couple minutes. And he was like, all right, I got to finish I this. I don't remember it being that bad. He I did all right. It. I'm not a, I don't know. Oh, but uh, you guys are yeah. better at like critiquing crying. I don't know. I'm, I'm like, not like, I'm w- kind of with Nicole though, like, 
I was just there for like this whole like I wanted to see how it comes together with yeah. them trying to do this one shot masterpiece. Yeah. Um, um, I don't know, there were no stakes really except they set the time limit of like you have to get there by yeah. whatever. But halfway through, like when he wakes up and it's nighttime, at that point I'm like it's fucking impossible. Like he's not doing it. Yeah, he, we don't even know how too late. Yeah, we don't even know how far he is. Exactly. Like what's going and, on? And like he's injured, he's by himself, and like. I was just kind of like, I don't know. Like well, they don't do a very good job of telling you how far they've come. Like, I think exactly, at the beginning yeah. they say it's yeah. like six miles or something, yeah. but you, they, you never check in again. So, like, at the nighttime when he wakes up and it's right, dark, when he gets you don't to know that how far city, he is. You're yeah. like, where yeah. is he? Yeah, well, did true. they say that they weren't really sure? They were like, we're not really sure. Yeah. yeah. Like yeah they were kind of over like here. Yeah. 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 Roughly six miles. Yeah. And well, like, bro, do we not have map? Yeah. We but have then his no map, idea. didn't yeah. his map get all bled on? Oh, yeah. So well, how did he really make it? Now it seems kind of far-fetched when I'm thinking about his, it. When, he, he when his friend died, it was in yeah, it was friend, in his... Friend. <laughs> 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 it's a, it's a, a little person. We can see who I liked better. <laughs> but, um, I liked him, the little, little guy. Joffrey? The little yeah. Joffrey. <laughs> Joffrey. <laughs> what's, what's his chap? What's his chap? Not jo- uh, Tommen. Tommen. Yeah. Tommen. I like Tommen. Yeah. But Wait, oh, that's I'm Tommen. sorry, what? It's he Tommen. Played Tommen in it's yeah. Tommen? Yeah. 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 He said that too, and I'm like, how did you not see that? <laughs> I didn't. That? You know what? I, I knew. Not, he's grown I up right now. I, can, I totally right. saw it, like, that's right, right away. I was like, oh, yeah, that's Tommen. Right. Okay. And what's George McKay in? I don't think he's a big yet. I think he's been on like plays and stuff. I haven't mm. seen him in movies. Interesting. I've seen him in something else, but I, I can't yeah, I know. That's why I'm, I'm thinking of the other movie. He yeah. looks yeah. like he'd be a good villain, honestly. Huh. Like a good like Gosh, asshole. Dang it! I need to look now. Um, Just ignore me. Someone <laughs> else talk. But <laughs> there's three of us. Dude, I mean, it got it's got like really good reviews and stuff. I don't think I, I'm kind of with you, Nicole. I was. It's more. This movie oh, just oh. feels like more of like an experience, like not an experiment. More than like, yeah, hey, I want to make oh, I want to make a, a World War One movie. Mm-hmm. We haven't really mm-hmm. seen like, maybe there's obviously there's probably black and white World War One movies, but we haven't like had like a true World War One movie. I don't think. I um, yeah. How I can't even think of one. Uh, Everything is World War Two based. Dunkirk is World yep. War Two based. I haven't seen that. Like, yeah. it, to me, it felt a lot like Dunkirk, but it I, felt a lot yeah. like it in terms of there not being a normal story progression. Yeah, the like last a, the another true. war movie you would see. Yeah. Um. So they did. There was, all quiet on the eastern front. All quiet. Well, western yeah. Front, all quiet on Is the that western. Is that a western? Front. One. No, of no, no, no. It's so a it book. Yeah, it, yeah, it's a book. I read the western front book. And it's a. Um, That's probably that. It's for school. <laughs> yeah, it's an anti-war <laughs> film that is basically can't tell you what day happened. in the life of a the like soldier. a a German regiment. Okay, yeah. uh, anti-war. What is like? What does that entail? Like, what do they show? In anti-war. The movie they're or? saying like war isn't go- like. No, but like, what do they show in the movie to get that message across? So the shit. Of it. Yeah, <laughs> basically <laughs> that. It, yeah, it's a disaster. Like is everyone Jarhead dies. Jarhead is an anti-war. Yeah. Anti-war. Okay. Because it's in mental health, like how it yeah. fucks yep. you up. Yeah. 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 Okay. And uh, there's a similar scene in All Quiet on the Western Front where uh, he goes back home and he's just like everybody's freaking out, you know? And they're like, oh, yeah, you just got to yeah. be all happy. <laughs> He's like, like, hmm, you just, people are dying left yeah. and right. I don't, I don't know. Uh, so um, what's Saving Private Ryan? Is that anti-war? That's just a war movie. That's just <laughs> a war movie. Do you think that's, that's anti-war? Isn't that based on something, though? Uh, yeah, D-Day. was that? D- <laughs> D-Day. I mean, they, they, they like that. D-Day's the first scene. So. D-Day, yeah. Like, <laughs> by know. far Spielberg, the right? best Spielberg? the best scene you'll, you'll watch in a yeah, war movie right there. Yep. It's pretty good. And Nolan tried, right? It's pretty good. And Spielberg ran with the camera. Oh. Yeah, no stabilizer or any. He, <laughs> so they did it with no. They did it with no camera stabilizer because. Really. So th- it's like chaotic, just like. Oh. That. I gotta watch behind the scenes. Dude, now. it's such that the whole like beach thing, the whole yeah. D-Day beach scene was nuts. Like the amount of um, explosives they had in the ground, all these actors just. Running onto the beach. Yeah. That would have been fun as fuck. But no. <laughs> 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 I mean, it would have been extra? fun. But My thing they only did it once, I think he said. Like, really? They, mm. they set all this up. It took them like, forever to set it all up. And they're like, okay, we. Yeah. Figure like, it out. <laughs> yeah. There's going to be explosions and shit. You're just going to run to that hill Crazy. and yeah. figure it out. Dang. Someone gets blown up. My for thing real. <laughs> with this movie, and like, I haven't watched a lot. And so I feel very uninformed saying this. But. It felt like nothing was going on. That's very, like, kind I, of... I get that, though. I understand that. You know, but yeah, like, it's a, that's that very before. insensitive to say, I think. But, I, like, I just kind of wish that there were more stakes 
you weren't I think you weren't drawn into the main our main characters either. We weren't really like we didn't yeah, really know I wasn't much about them. To them. Like okay, him and his brother yeah. cool, but like Buddy dies what? so early, so you're like, what? Like but also why did he pick him to go with him on this journey? Like he it said he said it was random, but it seems like they had a camaraderie before. And it before. Didn't I mean they were that. sleeping next to each other too. Yeah. So. Well no, he said you could have picked anybody and he was like you just looked like you've been here before or something. Right? Oh. What did he say? Mm-hmm. He said something he like, I remember you look like you've been here longer or something like that. But it, the the way they talk to each other seems like they knew each yeah. other longer. Um, but just like I hate to compare it to, but Saving Private Ryan, there's a lot of sad shit going on in there. But oh, that movie's so good. That you know you're looking to find the man to tell him his brothers died. Right? That yeah. was their goal. Mm-hmm. That was their mission. No, they're going to the get. Way, they're going to get Matt happening. Damon. Matt Damon's in so Matt much Damon. shit. Dude. When Matt you think Damon. about it, you're just like, what? I hate Matt. <laughs> I really what? Yeah, I they're going to get Matt Damon because his three bros died. <laughs> on and they want to tell him. Day. But in between yeah. that, some shit happens and you see it. Oh in this one, God. I feel like they shy away from that. And this stabbing, this stab scene or saving Private Ryan stab scene. You know what I'm talking about. Which one's better? Yeah. Wait, what's the stab scene in Saving Private Ryan? Dude, I, forgot it. Yeah, I cringe every time it's that. Who gets stabbed? Mm. What actor? I don't even I'm remember. not telling you. Yeah. Have you seen Man, it? We got to watch. Which, we gotta like, which one do I dislike more? <laughs> No, like which one? Which well, one, I guess it would be which one hits you harder. Hits you harder, yeah. I think the Saving Private Ryan one. Is. I don't, you know. You probably have more investment in the characters in Saving Private. Ryan. I do. You know what? It's and the worst part of I'll just say yeah. it. Yeah, say it. The worst part about it is because the guy who dies is a Jew. Yes. And he dies by the Nazi knife that the Hitler uses to kill Jews. Oh no. Well, um, it wasn't that the guy that they And the guy that they let go. The guy that they let go. So is the guy that like kills him. Yeah, so, so it's, it's ca- like this all this yeah. shit. Wait, so, so that's so like good Tom storytelling Hanks dies? right there. No. What? Uh, well, Tom well, Hanks dies? No. Well, <laughs> I mean, <laughs> <laughs> Well, no, not at that not part. Then. <laughs> yeah. Dude, and a lot of them die. So, so like that's Tom Hanks dies of old age. I gotta watch again. The I old guy, the forever. old guy at the beginning is Matt Damon, oh, bro. Okay, my bad, my bad, my bad. <laughs> We're gonna go home and watch it. I know, I know. We gotta watch it's it. on TNT every fucking year. <laughs> every second, it's on <laughs> TNT. Is it really? It, like it literally, really it's gosh. Wait, I don't think or we Spike, get Spike TV or something. Probably. We definitely don't. Well, it's, it's usually around. What's the anniversary? June six, fourth, uh, something like that. June fourth is. Yeah. Really? June fourth, nineteen forty-four. I think so. Forty-four. Sure. The day that we live in. That infamy. sounds like it. Oh wait, no, no that's, that's the other way. That's the December that's Pearl, Pearl Harbor. Yeah, yeah. That's Pearl Harbor, Michael Bay romance, no <laughs> romance. <laughs> um, I can take you don't want to. I cry, it, man. <laughs> take it or leave it. Take when really? Danny yeah, dies, cool. I cry. Okay, <laughs> it's Josh fucking Hartnett? sad. Yeah. That's yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Take it or leave it. It's not a pot of I remember I, ha- I, exactly. Exactly. I remember I had come when you don't accept yeah. your We had the the disc and it was on two discs because it was so big. And back then oh, the movie right. was that's so right. long. Like that Titanic. Right. I, yeah, yeah, Titanic. The movie was so long it was on oh two discs. And yep. you it ends after the Japanese destroy Pearl Harbor and you're like, fuck and it's like insert disc two. And you're like, <laughs> Yes. <Stop. laughs> like, oh we must God. see what happens next. Oh I remember my that. God. Like oh, Oh man! man. Shit. <laughs> well, that doesn't happen anymore. <laughs> Wait, so did you dislike stuff? Yeah, I'm I'm with Nicole on like I didn't feel invested really on these two guys. Like, I get the story and blah blah blah, but I just I don't understand. I feel like it's just more of like let's just do a cool like one shotter, yeah. like about war. Like, okay. um, Private Ryan has like so many other story arcs in it. Like every character has like a story arc, and these people die there was too. None of that and exactly. there's nothing really no. here. And, and when it ends, it's really like okay. cool. Yeah, it now ended. What? Exactly. But like yeah. you're kind of wondering, like, well, he didn't really. He's not fulfilled. I don't think. No. Like, because his friend died. Now he's with some and random. Yeah, and troops. now he's with these random yeah. this group, and it's just kind of like I, I don't remember. I guess ending. maybe it's going he sits for. Sits down in like a field. He sits yeah. down in the field. Yeah. So. And he's kind of like just relaxing. Yeah, but I thought he the sits pictures. down in the film at the uh, at the infirmary. Yeah, yeah that's he away looks from at it. like a that picture of his kids. Of his yeah. of his family, yeah. which Girls. is like the first thing. Uh, does he even mention he has family? He, uh, he keeps going in his pocket like he has uh, a picture, and, like, and you know says, he has a picture. Yeah. In there. He says like saying goodbye to his family yeah. was like okay. too hard or something. That's why like I thought that. he went back but home and saw them. Right, he but did. it wasn't like whether he was saying goodbye to his like wife and kids. It was just like his family. So you were like, oh, mom and dad. He felt younger to me. Really? Yeah, so yeah. Yeah. but everyone was married when they were Yeah, young, this right? was yeah. early. <laughs> yeah, I mean, he, could, he was 14. Yeah, he had two kids. <laughs> yeah, he was, yeah. you know. Life expectancy. Right. They were in college. Right. 
Well, it's like once he hits 35, he's going to die. So. Yeah. Right. But old age. I think, you know, I maybe the movie's going for that, but I don't think I like that version of it. Like, yeah. I, I'd rather it be more in-depth for them. And the, me, the movie, I think they're just, like Sam Mendes is trying to just say, like, that's it. Like, that was his mission, and now he's going to go do his next thing. Like, it's going to be just continually fighting. Okay. Yeah, but you're kind of just left like what you're not fu- i feel Sorry. like i wasn't really like fulfilled i was just like cool like the <laughs> scene where the kid <laughs> dies and he's like show me grab the picture and show him you know like he wants yeah. to see his pic- the picture for the last time you see it and you're like all right like it's a sad <laughs> scene but you're also yeah. like yeah. i don't know you that well yeah. i thought i was gonna be with you this whole movie right, right. i don't know your brother at all he doesn't even sound like a decorated soldier in this thing. They aren't. I mean, they I don't aren't. Think he is. So oh, his brother. Like, yeah. His brother. Yeah. It's not like, I, I, you know, I I'm know. just insensitive all around. But just like, it's like, okay, whatever. I don't know. I didn't feel any attachment, and I need that for my movies. I understand yeah. that. Yeah. What about you? You had something. You yeah. What like? did you just like? Um, it's it's much of the same, but. Is like I don't like it, but it's also very fitting. Yeah, you know, mm. nameless soldiers going That's to what do I'm like saying, like super heroic things, getting killed, and nobody knows about it. Nobody knows. Yeah, and really, World War One did nothing. Yeah, like, it really did nothing. It set up World War Two. Mm. You know, yeah, well, even more 15, people. 20 I years think. Later, I think that was it. I, that's what I'm saying. I think that's what the overall story is trying to tell okay. us. But I'm also kind of. It's just not. I wouldn't pick it if I had yeah. if I had yes. like Pearl yes. Harbor and Saving Private Ryan in 1970 right. in front of me. I would honestly pick other ones. Right. Would you pick that. this or Dunkirk? I haven't seen Dunkirk. <laughs> That's a hard one. Cause I didn't care for Dunkirk. You were you were saying it's very similar. It is. It's more of like Dunkirk is just a series of Visuals. events. And it's all in one place. Uh, well, yeah, it's but all with different that. viewpoints, right? Yeah, it's but like it's the it's like the events of Dunkirk. Dunkirk shown from different perspectives okay. yeah okay. i would absolutely pick dunkirk i would pick it oh. but absolutely. it is very similar yep. nameless people yep. you you don't have any dialogue really tom hardy's just a pilot like <laughs> i showed up for tom hardy barely yep. got him fair enough um, like in this movie <laughs> like you showed beautiful up the shots kid. like it's just it's all the same how long i is thought it? this was way pretty how long is it yeah. this was like two hours i think like okay. normal okay yeah. i thought it was like three hours Cillian Murphy's in it too. Um, Nolan, Nolan, uh, Nolan, the Stable. Nolan cast is yeah, in it. Nolan cast, except Christian Bale. No Leo cast. If I had to pick, like I was saying, I didn't dislike anything, but I think that like there was no checking in. Like I said, like, yeah, we don't know how far along you don't know where he's at. Yeah, we don't know if point. he's close. Yeah, when he wakes up, what if you just uh, know like he's should you you're you're, bas- you're basing your like expectations off of the lighting. Of like, oh shit, yes. it's nighttime. He's done. Like, but you don't know. Because it was yeah. distance. By Again, dawn, though, right? like it was like six a.m. or something. Yeah, yeah something yeah. like that. Again, to Patrick's point, that's like he doesn't know. Yeah. Well, and like, like the really. landscape's completely changed. Yeah. There's no trees. There's no no way to check in. You're by yourself. I mean, it, and it's map like, is apparently it all makes sense, but I just can't. Yeah, you I can't. can't yeah. Do, you, yeah. do we buy it as yeah. a movie? Is yeah. like the thing. Yeah. So, yeah. I feel like it's a big experiment. I like the experiment. Um but do I buy it? I don't know. The dude even have a freaking compass, dude. <laughs> that's <laughs> that's yeah. true. Yeah. No. No, that's true. Like, how did he end up at the right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's, yeah. There's no. I would have been left no and way. right, but. He did ask for directions once, and they told him the river, and mm-hmm. then he just had to stop when he hit bodies. And oh yeah. So. He met the girl. Was it a girl? I think it was the girl with the baby. She. He was like. Yes. Yeah. Told, yes. Yeah. She told him. Like, yeah. I also river, found yeah. it kind of funny that like the other group that picks him up, his troops, and they're like, "Okay, see ya, bro." Like yeah. he's like this yeah. is this All is where right. I get off and they're like this. okay yeah. yeah and they're like do you want to like, swim with you no. was a wall a thing back then uh, it it was absolutely I would a be thing. like this guy's going a wall yes. right now a wall was a uh, desertion <laughs> was like, a thing yeah. and a lot of people got shot but There's who were uh, those guys those were his like in the uh, truck yeah. British yeah. troops yeah those were uh, BEF soldiers that but were I think where were they on the way to though a different front different front yeah he just seemed so intense that they were like there's no way he's leaving like well he had at that time he still had orders. So Those w- it sounds like important orders though. Like yeah. they wouldn't be like, oh, okay, l- let's listen to this guy, and like let's maybe go with him. The trust must have been so different because if someone if that happened now, we'd be like, okay, man. Yeah, like, I think what this movie was battling was, hey, do we do a group of soldiers? And then they're like, it's too Saving Private Ryan-y. Mm. and then mm. and so they were kind of like, okay, we'll just do two. Like if they really had five people, you would have been like Saving Private Ryan hash. You know, like everyone yeah. would have burnt yeah. on it. Like we've seen this before. Like it's different, but. Um, you know, so they kind of had a. I think they thought about that. Like, what do we do? Two people, one person. 
They did both. Yeah, I just wish they would have linked it to something like an yeah. actual historical event. Because in yeah. like it's just so in easy, the king, so did you guys watch the king on Netflix yet? No. Mm-hmm. Okay. They they the battle with Robert Pattinson at the end that yeah. that's based on like a true yeah yeah, event. yeah I remember that I remember that even though they're not like this is the battle of yeah. you know mm-hmm. it's like based on that battle that. so I like, thought you meant yeah, like it was during World more. War One and I was like no what the <laughs> fuck no, I was like no it's not <laughs> it was whatever <laughs> the fuck <laughs> <that was, laughs> yeah World War One uh, <laughs> they had they had knights and armor called the king I feel like Patrick would like that movie. Uh, would, the king? Yeah. It's like I think you would get a good, good laugh from Pattinson's performance. Oh mm. no, is it supposed to be funny? Oh, no. it's terrible no, French. Terrible French. He, oh. he plays the no. he, he plays the what it, it Dauphine? Dauphine. 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 You guys haven't talked about that, right? We have. We have. We have okay, we have. that's when you're talking Timothy. about. No, that's when you're talking about the accents and stuff. Oh yes. yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah, Timothy. So I think probably based Charlie. on what you said, I was like, I don't need to see that. It has <laughs> a great soundtrack, though. I love the soundtrack. Really? Huh. I don't yeah. remember you talking about that, but I'll check it out. <laughs> Just the listen to our episode. For this movie is really good. I yeah. was listening to it okay. before we started. Recording. Oh, and this it's really good. Okay. I don't even remember it. Just for some historical reference, there were instances of uh, cavalry soldiers like carrying pikes and going. In, in the in the no in, in, well, not, well not isn't by that, that time, okay? But like early, really I just early thought of another of World War One one, War Horse, right? Isn't that World War One? I? I don't think I've ever seen War Horse, but, but it's World War One, I think. I What's that one? Who's don't in? Don't know. What year? It's Spielberg, I think, too. What? Sorry. Oh, oh yeah, I yeah, I think you're right. Sorry, I think you're right. Spielberg. It it's dude, it, the horse dies. I mean. Oh, it's an actual horse. Bro, oh, it's about the cavalry. He's no. mentioned it. He, he brought oh. it up. He literally. Oh, I thought you were talking about men cavalry. I didn't know cavalry meant horses. Well, cavalry, yeah. yeah. Now it means like yeah. men on horses, like tanks and stuff. Wait, wait. So they would send horses in j- because they knew the horses would die and that, that would stop them? No, no, no. Like there was like men on these horses <laughs> carrying pikes, uh-huh. like this big to long stab motherfuckers. In World War One. Stab people. In World War One. <laughs> like early, early on in the war. Like yeah. I mean, th- this is the first instance of like mechanized yeah, anything warfare. and like modern war technology. So it's crazy. Yikes. It's wild. Dude, it's not war even that horse. Long, that's a hundred years ago. That's the next. Ago. Yeah, yeah. Good God, one hundred and three. Crazy. Yeah. Well, yeah. we won't be alive for too many more. So. <laughs> Corona's <laughs> gonna get us all. <laughs> Corona, Corona, I, and I the. I stand and by. Millennials just, are immune. I'm just not scared of it. Millennials, <laughs> <laughs> sorry. <I'm> serious. <laughs> Until you text me next week. I, look at where I work. I would have gotten it by now. I'm not. Bro, even it's kidding. four I'm week incubation, bro. <laughs> that's right. I, I thought it was two to fourteen days. That's. No, oh, no for a week I heard it was the longest cruise train. So after no. a month, right, I well. think we're out of the. Cr- I think you're out of the woods. I think you're fine. Oh, like that it's hit Arizona already and it's gone now. No, like if you're exposed, it, he's saying 14 weeks before you know what. No, it's not, four. No, four, weeks. four weeks. Four weeks. That's what I mean. Exactly. That's what I mean. When I say 14 weeks, period. I mean four. That means four. <laughs> weeks. I'm good. Can you imagine? Be like, yeah, I was exposed to the virus, and <laughs> in October <laughs> you're gonna get sick. <laughs> like, oh, good God. Yeah. And so it just a disaster. Now. So I think <laughs> it was. Yeah, I think it was 2018 was when I was exposed. Exposed. <laughs> <That's right. laughs> oh, I'm sorry. All right. Gosh. <laughs> then we would really be screwed. You know how long, how much that would. Spread? We don't even know it's what we did. Uh, we're good. <laughs> I think so too. We're fine. No, I'm with you. No well, one our age six, has died, well, right? If you're or 60 plus. Yeah, out. but that's the same as the flu every single exactly. year. Come on. Okay, but just just for I mean, like just for reference, obviously I know that there's not, you know, there's not a first world war, but July 31st to November 6th, a half a million people died. From artillery shells Each day? No. Well, from from, from July 31st oh, to oh. November 6th. Wow. He's just comparing it to deaths. Is Th- and this is, this is the Battle of Passchendaele, which I, I think is what they were trying to do. Referencing. Yeah. Oh. It's, it's, it's in 1917. It's around that time. And um, it, it's the one that I think is because uh, there, there was no tanks also. But um, I mean, people are just dying left and right. Like it's it's this half a million. Half a million. Half a million. Wait, in World War One overall? No, 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 so just no, no, no that's battle. just this in one this battle, battle, battle on okay. this one little strip of front. So, like, yeah. there are hundreds of miles of front, and Damn. it's all over the world where so people are still also dying. Yeah. Yes, right, no, right, right, right. The fall off of deaths in wars are dramatic. I mean, obviously, the wars yeah. aren't at the scale, but they're dramatically smaller yeah. now. Yeah, well, is, like, correct me if I'm wrong, they could only estimate, right? Because people Well, most people, would, yeah, you're just they, like. Yeah, and they would ha- bury them and, like, not know. So, like, it's only. Or, an like, well, body yeah. parts are left. You don't yeah. know how many exactly. people this That's is. That's why you wear dog yeah. tags on your feet, yep. your chest, your arm. Put it on your toe. But then you have to trust that you can count dog tags only, that's true, you know? Yeah. And it's stuff yeah. like that. You still don't know. But that's also the way they would confirm, like, yeah. and send that to their family. Identification, yeah. Like, yep. 
unless they, unless they're gonna send them to your arm and be like, hey. Yeah. Oh my! But no, like, when you're they have gonna to get buried in a, in a mass grave. Yeah. Dental <laughs> records <laughs> to identify people. Gosh. Horrifying. Yeah. So. Anyway. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> we're just <laughs> death all over. Yeah, you know. You know. Um, that's all I got, guys. We gotta get into the shots. Um, we love, and then our scores. Yeah. So who wants to go first? Shots we love. I like going down. Down the river. Hello? Down yeah. the river. <laughs> um, so you'll have to help me with the scoring, but the shots I loved, I definitely love the church. Well, I mean, <laughs> you, you got. I that. ruined it for Patrick because I said I was easy. Yeah, like, uh, um, okay. But that what's making si- it good, bro. Yeah, the silhouettes yeah. in, the, in exactly. the dark, you know, yeah. that's that, that mine. was really that cool. That was mine, yeah. Like the flashes. Also, like yeah. but if you were the German soldier, you wouldn't run and shoot. I would have stood. You you guys shoot. You take your stance. I would never run. That was free. Can't hit anything. Yeah. Yeah, no. I mean, <laughs> you're running and shooting that rifle. That was yeah, very that, creepy. And yeah. it didn't work out. No. <laughs> didn't go well for him. No. They got to make an excuse. And the reload time, right, is like. It's a car, like, car yeah, 98. It's a, well, that's a bolt action. It's like, it's it's a K98. It's got a bullet like, yeah. for, for the camera. <laughs> <laughs> the like, They're pretty big learning. bullets, yeah, right? That's a pretty big bullet. Yeah. Yep. Absolutely not. Um, yeah, shot so. I love is when he's, like, trying to get over the horrifyingly disgusting river and, like, climbing <laughs> the side of the bridge. Yeah. And he's being shot at by the sniper. Oh, yeah. Oh, that was a good, that was, a good, that was good. very oh. tense It scene. was really good. Yeah. Tense, beautiful. Uh-huh. I love all that. Every well, time like you shot in it, we were in Dolby Atmos, no sponsors. <laughs> <laughs> but it was loud, man. Hashtag. It was like. Hashtag Dolby. <laughs> and you're like, he has no protection from this yeah. bridge. Again, but he has though, to get across. He's the only one. It's like, we wouldn't have a movie if he died. I don't really he might have got true, shot. True, true. You would have been like, even, <gasps> I don't even think it was because of like the yeah. high stakes that I yeah. liked. It. I liked the shot. You just it liked was the shot. really nice. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty. Well, camera movement there. That's floating over the water. Mm-hmm. They're like in a canoe. And just like, a lot of their it's such a lose lose where he is. It's just disgusting. So a lot of those yep. camera yeah. movements were like from people to cranes. Li- like while filming so crazy the, wow. the, the shot when he comes out of the trench to do the run yeah it's from guys and they the put it on the crane when he stood oh. up then they were dressed as extras and then they put their helmets oh on my gosh, and then ran cool. oh, that's and then that's so cool. like they had to do a lot of that's that cool. i like that so. and well and they built their trenches. and then yeah and this yeah. one with the with the water it was camera to a wire and then it crossed that's the cool. river someone Damn. else is waiting camera cool. okay so really really cool stuff with that but yeah i like that nicole here um up. mine is the where they made it to the farm right before the kid dies i keep calling him the kid <laughs> i don't remember he was he was like he was yeah. felt like right he felt yeah. very yeah. young yeah. 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 yeah um right before so they're like searching the house to make sure it's empty and there's a shot where you see the guy who lives <laughs> and it pans and it's the window and through the window you see the kid and they're facing different ways oh yeah but it's like his silhouette uh, it's like it, it, i like that shot a mm-hmm. lot just the mm. juxtaposition of like I don't okay know. that was cool dude i'm gonna go with the way fair singer scene whatever Aww. it's called of him slowly panning in on him or what? yeah so the camera george Mackey sits down at the tree Mm-hmm. camera keeps going goes through all the troops to the singer yeah turns around and goes back you to george you've been doing sequences i like movie. but that's a good <laughs> <laughs> no i know single I like shot movie yeah, dude so there i don't think there was a but category. that was right, like right. the first restful yeah and yeah. that was like a moment for all of us to kind of like defeat because he's like i give up like I'm yeah. but you know yeah. it was like defeat because they're getting ready to go and he doesn't yeah. even that's know that's like who they this are whole yeah well it's not registering it seems like he didn't register that like oh shit this is like this these are the guys that he didn't know he didn't know he asked I don't he was like who are you guys yeah. and then he's like they're like no that's you know, us and no that's what he said he's like yeah. we're the fourth wave or whatever and he's like what? what yeah and that's when he started running through all the people and then that's where we get the trench and all that that's explosion a good scene. Okay. scene so okay. um and i'll start with the oh, yeah, shot around. score yeah. Yeah, so explain zero, it for Patrick. Yeah, explain yeah, it for okay. Patrick. Zero yep. being the best movie you've ever seen. You don't need a drink in your These life. These are like sober. alcohol shots. shots. Yeah, alcohol, alcohol shots. shots. <laughs> 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 he loves it so much. Oh, <laughs> my <laughs> gosh. Okay. And, yeah, yeah, and five sure. out of five being you need to be blackout drunk because you movie. don't want to remember the movie. You've ever okay. seen it. Um, you can't right. enjoy it unless you're black. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. I'm, so much better. I'm going to so go better. with dose shots two shots can you guess nicole's though yeah. I, I need that now she loves it See, she, I love she it. loves when i, I love it so <laughs> he guesses I love it right too. Every time. Uh, i love it too I, i'm gonna go two shots because i like like i said the experiment i think i would like to see more of these movies but in different scenarios like not war movies 
do something and not action movies like do something like super unique with like a drama or something that okay. you just watch you don't even know don't even market it as it yeah mm-hmm. exactly just make it happen was this one marketed that way yeah okay that's yeah. why you guys yeah. are like yeah okay. I mean, it was like leaked before, and everyone okay. like because it was the first war know, movie yeah. to be done like that. It's not like we haven't seen a one shot yeah. movie before, sure. but they were like the first war movie that's one shot. Whatever. It's okay. Just like okay. <laughs> <laughs> you just don't like war movies. I don't. But <laughs> I would have liked to see Saving Private Ryan one shot. Yeah. And well, I would like that's to see anything hard. like it that. It would have been hard, but, but I mean, they don't sleep, do they? The they church? do like in the church, I guess. Yeah, in the church, yeah. the one okay. spot. Yeah. I know, that movie's like yeah, back of my hand, bro. <laughs> <laughs> so good. Um, yeah, two. And Nicole, I think Nicole is gonna throw. If I get it wrong, I'm gonna feel I know. so bad I now. Know. I want it to be when two. I'm here. When I you know. get it wrong, that's fine. Nicole's probably gonna throw a three down. No. Four? No. Oh, no, you're I'll give it a four. Oh, you're gonna give it a two. Then? I will give it a two. Damn. Wow. Okay. Because I thought she was gonna hit it harder than that. Yeah, me too. If 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 it had won the Oscar, yes, absolutely. If it beat Parasite, oh, be absolutely. That, you can't just but give bad Yes, I can. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah, it beat Parasite oh, five like out of five. Oh, it's a conspiracy? <laughs> like everyone knows everyone and they pulled strings? No. You can't blame the movie. Uh, it's the Oscar. It's Hollywood. It's not the movie's fault. I can fault. blame the movie for being... You, I, f- <laughs> I think that Save, he... Bro. <laughs> Save it. <laughs> no, I feel like... What's the point of more war movies? And I think I like them. <laughs> yep. But this one's kind of what was the point of it? No, I know. Because I get you. except for the technique. Yeah. And it's like he could have done that with anything, but he chose the war movie. The way he Grandpa, marketed it, dude. Grandpa. The way he released it to where it would be in the Oscars. Like he released it at the last possible second of counting okay. as an Oscar. They did thing. do the weird we come Limited out in release. we come out in December at select theaters, oh, okay. but it okay. didn't come out until we saw until it. January until like oh, so it's just like just to make a lot of I Oscar kind of they do that the movie, sometimes, but yeah. I but I'm it would have been just the following year. Yeah, it would have, but right? not like early. It Usually, the early movies get glossed over. You can't give an award to a movie just because it's a war movie. Late movies are like Oscar did. season. They, they feel call better about it. Yes, I feel better, but I can kind of fault the movie. Um, but that's why I'm giving it a two because I know a lot of work went into it. It did feel like his personal movie. Yeah, it did. It good. did feel like he was yeah. really like invested in invested in, in like yeah. exactly. I'm not gonna take that away from him and I don't like I I'm not gonna shit on the movie. It was a fine movie. Um Yeah. Yeah. So just a two. It was it was fine. I respect it. I respect cool. the movie. I'm gonna say one. Nice. Mm, I liked it a lot. You I usually it, yeah. I don't usually like war movies that much, but I, because it was so pretty, I liked it a lot. Like I'd watch it, it again just so to see. Yeah. What other ones have you watched? Oh God. So I w- a lot. <laughs> Tell me, Patrick. You know how okay. Black Hawk Down. Oh, for sure, Black Hawk Down. A few independently, okay. mostly because me and Patrick are going to okay. start a war movie podcast. Oh, on and then we won't have to watch them. I've got a side note on that one. It's really good. I'm done. I'm in. That's okay. beautiful. Um, and We're I recording just, at the same time. I just want to clarify. <laughs> in the same room. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to clarify. Is it need or want? So need. I, I need to do this before it I watch it. doesn't matter. Or I want to do it this before matter. I watch it. Uh, if you're like, hey, you need to be this drunk to enjoy this film. Yeah. You need to be, I would say. I need. Okay, okay. Yeah. need. Then I'd probably say it too. Wow, I was the lightest wow. on yeah. this. Yeah. Yep. Um, and just to preface, I love war movies they're the <laughs> i think they're the yeah. greatest genre but that's I, why he's harsh yeah because he yeah. knows so yeah. what's your favorite Manning. one war movie yeah if you don't say 13 hours i swear no, to Todd. no i say i say I, 13 what hours f- michael bay he freaking loves i love it michael i love it so it's because john, yeah. john krasinski john krasinski yeah, yeah. You never so it just got released it just it came, came out, out like 2012 no, 14 yeah 2014 in 2012 Freaking Jack. Jack, super Jack. Bro, this yep. was like his first big yep. Nicole, after office. Come on. Yep. Uh, where have you, you might actually like this one. It's not typical war. Oh, yeah. yeah. I want to see It's Jack about John the uh, Benghazi. <laughs> got, what is it? Benghazi, Benghazi. scandal. Dude, oh, Clinton okay, did back. it, bro. Back. It's Clinton. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. That's right. Who's Clinton? Hillary. He's, she yeah. doesn't send them any help. It's a whole thing. <laughs> oh, it's based on like real. It's a real It's a real event. Yeah, real event. Did you guys watch the report yet? No, we need to do that. See, I, I haven't I'm watched either. Driver, and it's like kind of conspiracy. See, oh, I love okay. journalism movies. I haven't, yeah, I haven't, okay. seen, that. I okay. haven't okay. seen that. I haven't seen okay. that. Okay, sorry. Yeah. No, 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 you're good. Uh, yeah, definitely too. Uh, What's your favorite? It, it, my favorite war movie? Yeah. Uh, you got to ask which war. Oh, That's true. There's a lot. There's of one per war. Uh, Vietnam. Platoon? 
He does like Platoon. I do love Platoon. Dude, <laughs> I, I, I for uh, me, we were soldiers. For though. me, I was gonna say, for me, I connect with We Were Soldiers more because yeah. when I was growing up, yeah. I watched We Were Soldiers a lot. Yes. But Platoon was like my dad was like, you know, watch. Well, Platoon. and Platoon is definitely an anti-war film. Yeah, we Were is. Soldiers is not. It's like a, it's a, it's a reenactment of a like a real event. Like, yeah. Um, you know, all from the guy who got his like skin ripped off. I mean, that's ah, a real no. event. Like, yeah. It's so it's so crazy. A real event. No. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. Um, so, but Platoon, Willem Dafoe, and all yeah, that. Yeah. Like, God, he's like he's like twelve. These God. are like all oh. you're describing all the DVDs in our home. Yeah. I, it's just Platoon and we're. We got to come over, Mark. Yeah. I took a history of war films class my senior what? year of college. Yeah. And I shit you not, the <laughs> hardest class. <laughs> I took in college. What? Really? Hands down. Like the papers you, you had to write about it, or you, write, you had to write super long papers. You had to r- watch every single movie like in second depth, by and it was second. it was just so time consuming. Yeah, I, w- I would be That's up until like two o'clock in the morning, but I was just drawn to it. Cause yeah, it was you liked it. Yeah. yeah. So I was really that excited fun. when you guys were talking about. Yeah. It. Imagine being me like in that class. Yeah. God, I would hate myself. <laughs> Absolutely not. Yeah. <laughs> me, me neither. Well, no. The the. The professor was a film producer, so I think that he offered like it, it wasn't about war and historical events; it was all about film. Yeah, so awesome. you might have liked it. Interesting. Who were we on? Where were we? Oh, we're done. That's it. He said two. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the show. Where were we? All right. That's it. Aww, 1917. Thank guys. you guys so much for coming on. Yeah, Thank thanks you. for having us. Yeah. Rick really Patrick really from uh, Let's Be Realistic LBR Podcast dot com. <laughs> right. Go out thanks, there. Guys. <laughs> Are you guys gonna make red stickers? Thanks I want for the, the red content. Sticker. Yeah, I have just. Yeah. No, I don't know. We'll talk. Okay, we'll, we'll talk about this in private. <laughs> okay. Behind the scenes. At dinner? Are we going to we'll, dinner? We'll talk, talk about numbers. that war movie uh, <laughs> podcast. <man. laughs> the spin-off. Oh, the spin-off. <laughs> Thank we you guys so much. <laughs> if you're if you're listening on Apple, make sure you write a review. Uh, follow us. Subscribe on you know Spotify and Apple Podcasts. And YouTube. What like and subscribe on YouTube, comment. Man, I'm asking so much from you guys. Please no, do, do so. Just do it. Do it all. Uh, do it's everything. not that much. Do everything. It's easy. You know, just just comment like just put the letter A or something, hit enter, and then then I know that you listened this those far. True. Comments. True. You gotta you gotta do that. So. You're right. You're right. <laughs> we appreciate you guys so much. Uh we will see you guys next Tuesday. Uh, have a great night. Doing. Yeah, we don't yeah. know what we're doing. <laughs> <laughs> As usual, but <laughs> have a great rest of your day, guys. Bye. Bye guys. Bye.